So Use Juice comes out and basically says, every little rap blog that don't post me no more, but be watching me, keep that same energy when my page come back. Now, I don't know what rap, I don't know what rap blog he's talking about exactly, but I'm going to say what we all been thinking. Use Juice fell off. He's still putting out music consistently, but it's not hitting consistently like it used to. He's putting out music consistently, but it's not hitting consistently like it used to. Back in the day, a rapper would start buzzing, and they really wouldn't fall off until after they had like a major hit single. Like, you know, usually rappers, they fall off after they feel like they made it, after they feel like they got enough money. Like, Fetty Watt fell off after he dropped four, five, six hit singles straight. I guess he felt like he was good. Nowadays, rappers get a local buzz. They get 100, 200,000 from a label or from streaming, and they feel like they made it. Yushi G's probably feel like he made it right now. That's why he fell off a little bit. Not saying that he can't come back or his music is so, so terrible, but his trajectory fell off a little bit after he started getting money. And it's not only for him. A lot of artists fall off after they start getting a little bit of money, seeing a little bit of success. What they was doing in the beginning that got them popping, that same kind of music, that same kind of work ethic. Once they good now, it slows down. It's hard to have that same hunger when you eat a steak and lobster every day, but you got a $30,000, $40,000, you know, necklace on, you feel me? A, a $30,000, $40,000 chain around your neck is it's difficult, you know, when everything is good, your mom is taken care of, you well fed, your health is good. It's hard to still have that same hunger now when you're in the hood and you don't have nothing to work. You don't have nothing going on. That hunger is different. That hunger is way different. I'm gonna be honest, yo. Mad rap blogs show you G's love from local, the major blogs. So the fact that he's even saying this just lets me know that he kind of knows he's falling off. He just kind of sees that it's kind of changing up a little bit from him. The positive is this: he's still young. He still got time to make some fire songs, some hits. The negative is that a lot of times artists usually fall off, the numbers drop, and then they start being afraid to drop. You should just don't worry about no blogs. You just did an interview with No Jumper. Those blogs are literally the reason why you got that interview with No Jumper. Because they was the first one supporting you. So there's no reason to come at any blogs. They helped you in the first place. Digital Thugs them out. Like, comment, subscribe. Check out um, the podcast on Spotify. Digital Thugs Podcast. Follow me on Instagram. Digital Thugs underscore.